The first ever Airbus Beluga transport aircraft has left Broughton for the last time. Beluga No. 1 departed the Airbus factory in North Wales on April 27 on its way to Hamburg for storage. It's the second of the original fleet of five A300-600ST transporters to be placed in storage, with Airbus updating its fleet to the modern Beluga XL. Beluga No. 1, the first to grace the skies on behalf of Airbus Transport International, has officially left the building. The aircraft, based on the A300, has been with Airbus since October 1995 and is a ripe 26.6 years old. As Airbus introduces more of the modern A330-based Beluga XL to its fleet, the original five are set to leave. The first to take retirement was Beluga No. 2, registered as Foxtrot Golf Sierra Tango Bravo, which last flew on October 6, 2020. The aircraft flew from Airbus's Toulouse home to Bordeaux for storage. Now, the first ever Beluga has taken her last flight for Airbus. Foxtrot Golf Sierra Tango Alpha took off from Harden in Flintshire at just after 1500 BST on April 27. It was a short 1 hour and 16 minute trip directly east to Hamburg. It landed at 1719 local time and headed onwards to Toulouse a few hours later. It then finally went on to Bordeaux on April 29th. Airbus has its own facilities in Hamburg to remove useful parts or otherwise do some decommissioning work with the aircraft. Beluga No. 2 also spent time in Hamburg before departing for storage in Bordeaux. Up until now, Beluga No. 1 had been fairly busy for Airbus. In the last 12 months, she'd flown some 458 flights, with an average monthly utilization of 57.1 flight hours. But with newer, bigger sisters joining the fleet, it's time for number one to reset her wings. To date, Airbus has taken delivery of two of the newer Beluga XL. These larger load shifters are based on the Airbus A330 and carry the designation A330-700L. The first arrived with Airbus Transport International in December 2019, and the second joined the fleet in October 2020. Interestingly, the two that are already flying for Airbus are XL2 and XL3. XL1 is yet to enter service, but is carrying the registration Foxtrot Golf X-Ray Lima Golf. AIB family shows that the aircraft has undertaken numerous test flights at Toulouse, the most recent of which was on April 9th. Perhaps it's almost ready to enter service, and as such, Beluga No. 1 was taken offline. Also incoming is Foxtrot Golf X-Ray Lima Juliet, which we would like to assume will be XL4. However, spotters are yet to see the complete plane emerging for flight tests, so it's likely to be some time before the fourth joins the fleet. The Beluga XL offers 30% more cargo capacity than the original line and will be essential for moving large parts like wings from production facilities to the final assembly lines for the plane maker. Airbus previously said it would seek ETOPS approval for at least two of the transporters, allowing them to fly transatlantic. Have you ever spotted Airbus's giant transporters? Let us know in the comments. In addition to our daily YouTube videos, Simple Flying publishes over 150 articles and a podcast every week. If you're looking for the latest aviation news and insights, visit simpleflying.com. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to like and subscribe before you go.